happy 3rd of December. Today I'm gonna celebrate December by painting some pine trees and I'm just gonna do a few practice runs here and then we're gonna, just gonna fill the page with beautiful pine trees here. And uh, Christmas trees are one of the main things of uh, Christmas, at least here in uh, Denmark. So this was so obvious. I'm gonna do this in a very loose style and uh, I'm trying to to uh, put in a few uh, layers of snow as well. So that's why you are watching me just paint these uh, green um, green uh, green areas here and this is a sap green I'm mostly using I'm only using sap green and paint gray here so when it's dried a little bit not all all the way dry uh, not completely dry you fill this uh, white space with water and just let it let the water kiss the green in a few spots so the the green will flow into the water and then we can add a little bit of paint gray here and um, Hopefully that will give the illusion of a, a beautiful snow covered tree, but do this a couple of times because it takes a little bit of practice to know how uh, when to apply the water when it's dry enough but not too dry and uh, not to add too much water because that will dry up a little uh, blotchy, but we're going to do a couple of them here. So we just put the top and then we have these um layers of green here i'm making quite a a big tree and it's a little thinner but still the same thing with the greens just adding a bit of paint gray as well to the blue uh, to the green just to spice up the color a little bit and now i'm going to add my water and you can see how it instantly flows into this uh, this sketchbook is new for me. It's a Mossery sketchbook and I'm just trying to figure out how much uh, How how my paints and, and water will uh, will affect this paper, but so far I'm really pleased. I think it's so much fun uh, I'm gonna put a link for it below so you can uh, get it for yourself It's really really cool and it's actually it actually has my name on front of it in in front of it in the front page yes so that's pretty cool as well just doing another one here and think this is turning into quite a forest you can see how quickly you can actually create uh, some really really cool christmas trees this is gonna be a little bit behind the other one and um, just same steps and you can vary the the areas of the green of course in and of course also how much uh, water you apply but the concept is totally the same first you add the greens then water when it's dried a little bit and then the paint gray in a few areas so it'll give the illusion of snow and i think you can do this if you don't have a paint gray you can try with the blue as well i think that would work uh, fine as well i'm putting links for my materials uh, below the video as well uh, so we can find it there. Here, just one more. I'm going to make this a little bit um, fl uh, fluffier, <laughs> a little bit, bit messy, uh, just to show that you don't have to con be controlled at all. And oftentimes, it's actually better if you're not. So, same concept here. Uh, and if you are still uh, in need of a couple of uh, christmas gifts you can actually purchase gift cards for my some of my online classes and uh, i think that would be the perfect gift this year because we're all staying at home anyway so why not uh, get your friends uh, the gift of watercolor and then you can maybe paint together that would be really cool uh, i'm gonna put a link for it as well uh, below and also for my online classes so you can uh, check that out here more trees this is really messy and i think that's kind of fun if you are unsure how uh, christmas trees or uh, pine trees look just uh, do a quick uh, google search don't copy just uh, see how the shape is and then uh, just make it your own you see i'm just adding a little bit of green 
where I want my my snow and that's just gonna give it a little bit more interest uh, with some branches peeking out of the snow. Here you go. And I think th this is it actually. I'm just gonna say these pine trees are done and uh, I will see you in a couple of days. Thank you for watching and make sure to subscribe.